The goal of Bitcoin mining is to find a hash, which is a unique string of letters and numbers. This will be randomly set by the mining network. Blockchain is a string of information. Each block represents a cryptocurrency transaction. Mining here refers to the finding of a new hash, and the reason it exists is for greater security because they don't want anyone and everyone to be able to affect this blockchain. It's also used for decentralization, which means no individual user can affect the entire chain, unlike a traditional bank, for example, where the CEO can affect every branch and ATM if they feel like it. If the problem is solved correctly, the miner records a new hash to the blockchain and is rewarded with Bitcoin for their own wallet. Miners can find this hash by using the SHA-256 function, which is secure hash algorithm and it's 256 bits. The problem they're solving is really more like a guessing game where they have to find the valid hash to identify the new Bitcoin transaction or the new block on the chain. We know where the cryptocurrency is coming from because it was the last location of the previous hash. Miners begin the guessing game with a number called a nonce, short for number used once. Each transaction has its own unique nonce that can never be repeated. Once that new nonce is identified and passed through the SHA-256 hash function, which basically means copy and paste the number and press enter, it'll produce a new hash. And that is going to be the new block on the blockchain. For example, let's say a cryptocurrency is exchanged today. Well, then the mining network which that currency is associated with will set a target hash, which starts with, let's say, 0, 0, 0, 0. The miner will start with a nonce, which is equal to 0, and then hashes the data as accordingly shown. The SHA function has the old hash plus the zero and it'll end up with something that begins with a three. Since that does not begin with the zero 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 we're looking for, it has to throw out a new number out there, which is, as you guessed it, one. And that's why you need these super juice computers because it's gonna keep on iterating from zero to one to I don't know how many billion it's gonna take, but just for the sake of example, the miner found a nonce of 52,749, which means the computer had to do that many iterations to find a hash that begins with 0000. zero, zero, zero. We can see there's more to it after that. There's a whole unique string of numbers and letters, which is the new hash that the miner was looking for. This is what will be recorded as the new block in the blockchain, meaning Mission complete, mining is done, and they get paid in Bitcoin or Ethereum or whatever cryptocurrency that the network was on. I'm sure there's more to Bitcoin mining than what I was able to explain. And if you're more familiar with the concept, comment down below, educate me, make me aware so I can learn more.